Hi and welcome to the final of our Prepare Him Room videos. It's really good to be able to share with you in this project and we hope it's been helpful for you as you've prepared for Christmas. The last reading that we're going to have is from Luke's Gospel, where Simeon confesses that he can depart this world in peace because his eyes have seen the Lord. He sees Jesus. He takes hold of the promise of God with his own hands. For, uh, for Simeon, uh, faith has become sight. He witnesses with his own eyes the arrival of Jesus Christ, and, and he's comforted by the reliability of God to his word. In a moment, Phil is going to read to us, and the band are going to sing, Peace Has Come. This Christmas, may you be reminded that peace is not the consequence of having everything ticked off on our things-to-do list. Peace is not scenic views or spa days. Peace is not the absence of conflict. It's the presence of a person. Peace is Jesus. Maybe this Christmas Eve, you could pray for your street, for your actual neighbors, that they would know the peace of Christ in their home and that you would have an opportunity to be a witness for Jesus over this Christmas period that you would be able to share something of the reliability of Jesus, of the peace of Christ this Christmas time with those who live round about you. Peace is not, peace is not the absence of conflict. It's the presence of a person. Let the words of scripture penetrate your heart and let this song of worship be an encouragement to you this Christmas time. Thanks for watching. Luke 2. 25 to 32. At that time, there was a man in Jerusalem named Simeon. He was righteous and devout and was eagerly waiting for the Messiah to come and rescue Israel. The Holy Spirit was upon him and had revealed to him that he would not die until he had seen the Lord's Messiah. That day, the Spirit led him to the temple. So when Mary and Joseph came to present the baby Jesus to the Lord as the law required, Simeon was there. He took the child in his arms and praised God, saying, Sovereign Lord, now let your servant die in peace as you have promised. I have seen your salvation, which you have prepared for all the people. He is a light to reveal God to the nations, and he is the glory of your people, Israel.
Jesus has come for our King.